and how we going guys welcome back to my part two of my round one tipping of tipping video <laughs> oh footy's back how bloody good is it <laughs> so yeah it's good to have it back um the two vegas games were very good even though i didn't get none in right i tipped souths they lost tip broncos they narrowly lost to the roosters by 10 points <coughs> anyway it goes on, so we kick off Thursday night with my beloved Knights. I'll be there as always um, at McDonald Jones Stadium, eight o'clock. Knights, Knights are dollar forty. Raiders two dollars ninety four. Mm, this is going to be a good one. If it's anything like um, last year's final, well, I'm wearing for a good one, but I don't see it being that close like it was. I think we're going to. Especially the second half, we'll run away with it. Um, I'm going my Knights by 1 to 12. Um, just looking at the team list here, and I only go through the Knights team list because I don't really. So, Pong at 1, Nari at 2, Dangi at 3, Bradman best 4, Greg Marju 5, him and Bradman, of course, they're going to have a good year this year. Brad, Greg is going to break Dom's try scoring record. Um, so Adam's gone with Tyson and Jackson at six and seven. I respect that. I thought it might have been Cogger, but let's see how this one goes because we know if they stuff up, there's always a few people behind them going to take their spot. So yeah, but I have faith in they'll do their job. And yeah, it's good to have, it's, it's good to have um, players that are on on the back on the back of their heels, keeping them in on tow. So, I think they'll do their job. But yeah. Anyway, moving into the forwards, we've got Jacob Safedi at number eight. Phoenix Cross at number nine. He's had a good season this year. Great one last year too. Um, Leo Thompson. Oh, he played good in the, in the Indigenous um, team. He's going to have a good season this year. Um, I think we want to lock him down too. We've got Tyson. He's going to have another good season. Dylan Lucas, good up and come, young boy, young player up and coming. Adam Elliott, he's going to have a good season too. Then interchanges are Jack Cogger, Daniel Safidi, Jack Hetherington, Kai Pierce Paul, who will make his debut for the club. Then we've got the reserve, we've got Jed Cartwright, Thomas Jenkins, Will Price, Brody Jones, and Thomas Kent. So yeah, that's the night side. We'll go through the Raiders, alright then. So we've got in the Backs, we've got Jordan Rapana at number one, Nick Kotrick at two, Matthew Tomiko. I think I pronounced the name right. Who this one? Uh, we've got Albert Hopawade at number four, Xavier Savage at five, up against Greg Marzu. That'd be one. Ooh, he'll have to be on his toe for that one. And we've got Ethan Strange. Now, I'm not sure. I think he's related to Jasmine Strange. I'm not sure. But I'll, I'll find out and I'll. If so, well, that's good for him. Good on him. Um, then we've got seven, Jamal Fogarty for the Raiders. Into the forwards, we've got Josh Papali'i. Papali or whatever, you know, however you pronounce his name. Danny Levi at nine, up against Phoenix Crossland. Joseph Tapine at number 10. Hudson Young, he always steps up against us. And we've got Zach Hosking at number 12. Morgan Smith is at 13 in the interchange for the Raiders. Tom Starling, he always does too, step up against the club. Knights, Emra Gula at 15, Ata Miyora, that's that right, hopefully, and then we've got Sami Sula, X Knight, at 17, then we've got Reserves, Ko Weeks, Simi Sagi, Zach Wolford, who also played for the Knights, James Schiller, 21, and Trey Mooney at 22, so yeah, there's the Raiders sign-up, so so I've gone the Knights, 12 plus. Moving on to Friday night over in New Zealand. That's going to be a good one. I think the Sharks will be will want to be up for it. Um, but I think with the home crowd advantage and the Warriors are wanting to kickstart their season, I'm going to go the Warriors 1 to 12. Then moving on to the next game on Friday night down in Melbourne. The Storm hosting the, the Premiers. Um, this one will be a cracker. 
and I mean it. Like, I've noticed most people are going the Panthers, but I just feel for on the upset. I'm going the Storm. They've never lost the opening round. I think it's 21 or 22, whatever it is, 21, 22. Yeah, they've never lost an opening round. So I'm going to go the Storm by two. Yeah. Then moving on to Saturday, we have the Eels <coughs> hosting the Bulldogs at Combank. Some of them have gone the Bulldogs. Some YouTubers, you know, YouTubers have gone, have tipped the Bulldogs. Yeah, they've tipped the Bulldogs. And I thought, hmm, okay. Mm. But I'm going to stick with my original tip, and that is Eels 1-12. to Then we move on to the next game on Saturday. I've got the Goldie. Titans versus Dragons. Desi's first game as coach. For the Titans. Um, first official game as coach, yep. And I'm going to see the Titans running away with this. The Dragons might have a fight a little bit, but I see the Titans running away with it. 12 plus. Yep. And so my final tip on Sunday, the Dolphins hosting the Cowboys at Suncorp, kick off at 4 o'clock. Um, it was a hard one because I was thinking, hmm, who do I tip? Dolphins or Cowboys? They've both got. I've looked at their lineups and too bad. But I'm going to go with the Cowboys 1 to 12. Yeah, so Cowboys 1 to 12. So, and the Tigers, they got the bye. So let's see if they can beat the bye. <laughs> anyway, so let's go through it again. Cowboys 1 to 12. Titans 12 plus. Eels 1 to 12. Storm by 2. Warriors 1 to 12. And my Knights 12 plus. So. Got it written down so I know who I tipped. Yeah. Okay. So that'll do it. Round one tips. That's continued on from my last video that I did. My Vegas video. That's what I called it. So yeah. Anyway, I'm going to get on out of here. Because I've got a thing other things to do. And yeah. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to do all that good stuff. Like comment and subscribe because I'm going to keep on doing videos. I'm going to try and get out some some nights vlogs. It's a bit hard because like I'm, as if you know I wave the big flag so it's but I'll try and do my best. I'll try and do a little bit. I'll try and get some people to film me waving the flag and whatnot. So yeah I'll try. As I say you can only try. Anyway enough rambling on. I'm going to finish on up, finish on up, and I will see you in the next tipping video. So until then, stay cool. Cheers.